Welcome back to Move with Nicole. Today's class is an energizing yoga flow that will leave you feeling full of energy and ready for your day. So when you're ready to get started, roll out your mat and let's begin. Let's start today's class kneeling at the back of our mat. Bring your legs together, sit up nice and tall, and just rest your hands on top of your thighs and close your eyes. Take this time to bring your awareness into the present moment, into your breath, and into your body. Inhale, fill your body up with beautiful positive energy and exhale, let go of what no longer serves you. Then carefully open your eyes and let's come on to our hands and our knees. On your inhale, arch your spine, roll your shoulders back, look up. Exhale, round your spine, press the floor away from you, drawing your belly button in. And again, inhale, arch your spine, roll your shoulders back, open through your heart. Exhale, round and gaze up towards your navel. Let's now circle our spine. So inhale, arch your spine and shift your body forward and back in one direction. Doing whatever feels good for you here. Let's do one more in this direction. And now reverse your circle. Inhale as you arch, exhale as you round. Moving intuitively here, doing what feels best for you. One more big circle. Beautiful. Return to a neutral spine. Tuck your toes under and press back into your first downward facing dog, keeping a soft bend through your knees to start. Really press the floor away from you, lengthening through your spine. Then slowly start to pedal your heels one at a time, stretching out the back of your legs. Keep pressing the floor away from you, making sure your shoulders are away from your ears. Then if you can, see if you can straighten both legs, pressing your heels down towards the floor, finding a moment of stillness in your down dog. Then on your inhale, ripple your spine forward to your high plank. Exhale, bend your knees and press back. And again, inhale, ripple forward, shoulders over wrists. Exhale, press back. Two more, really flowing with your breath here. And last one. Well done, inhale, ripple your spine forward again. Exhale, draw your navel in and then set your knees down, uncurl your toes. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, lower yourself all the way down to the floor. Interlace your hands behind your back. Roll your shoulders back. Inhale, lift your chest, lift your legs off the floor. Really opening through your heart center, strengthening through your back body. One more deep breath in. And then exhale, release down, coming on to one cheek. Let your body rest for just a moment. Then return through center, interlace your opposite finger on top. Inhale, roll your shoulders back, open your chest and lift everything up. Really squeeze your glutes, draw up through your navel. One more big breath in and exhale, release everything down, coming on to the opposite cheek. Take a moment to rest, maybe wiggle your hips side to side. 
Then place your hands by your ribs, roll your shoulders back, inhale, lift your chest, baby cobra, or maybe press up into your upward facing dog. On your exhale, press back to down dog. Well done. Take a nice deep breath here. Then look up in between your hands and tiptoe your feet forward. Inhale, halfway lift, keeping a soft bend through your knees. And exhale, fold. Press through your feet, roll up to standing, vertebra by vertebra. Reach your arms up, inhale. Then exhale, dive over your legs, bending your knees as much as you need. Halfway lift, inhale, nice flat back. Exhale, step back into your plank. Inhale, shift your weight forward, lower your knees. Exhale, bend your elbows, chaturanga. Roll your shoulders back, cobra. Inhale, or press up into your upward facing dog. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. One deep breath in, and deep breath out. Look up in between your hands, tiptoe your feet forward. Halfway lift, inhale, roll your shoulders back, fold, exhale. Roll up to standing, reach your arms up to the sky, big breath in, and exhale, dive forward. Halfway lift, inhale, exhale, step back into your high plank. Inhale, shift your shoulders forward, exhale, bend your knees and bend your elbows. Inhale, press up, upward facing dog. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Beautiful, really warming up our body here. Take one more deep breath in and deep breath out. Then tiptoe your feet forward to the top of your mat. Halfway lift, inhale, fold, exhale. This time, bend your knees, sit your hips slow. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, really bend into your knees. Draw your navel in, lengthen through the side of your waist and reach through your fingertips. Take a nice big inhale, then exhale, lift your heels and sweep your arms back. Inhale, drop your heels, reach your arms up. And again, exhale as you lift your heels, Inhale as you lower, keep going. Try to keep your knees nice and bent. Keep drawing your belly button in. Well done, inhale, chair pose, and exhale, fold over your legs. Halfway lift, inhale. Exhale, step back into your chaturanga, bending your elbows. Upward facing dog, inhale. Downward facing dog, exhale. Well done. On your next inhale, reach your right leg up to the sky. Exhale, bend your knee and open your hip. Try to keep your chest and your shoulders square to the floor as you really open that right hip. See if you can lift your right knee up to the sky a little bit higher on your inhale. Then exhale, pull your knee forward and step your right foot in between your hands. Pivot your back foot flat. Inhale, come up into warrior one. Exhale, really bend into your right knee. Inhale, lengthen through the side of your waist. Exhale, interlace your hands behind your back. Inhale, open through your chest. And then exhale, dive forward, bringing your body to the inside of your right leg. Make sure that your right hip doesn't pop out to the side. Keep drawing your inner thighs together using the strength of your legs. On your next inhale, press through your feet, lift your chest up, release your arms and exhale, open out into your strong warrior two. Nice deep breath in, and exhale, bend into your right knee a little bit further. 
inhale flip your right palm up reverse warrior exhale bend deeper into your right knee then inhale straighten your leg exhale press up inhale shift forward and exhale lower into your triangle pose holding on to the top of your shin your foot or the floor then on your next inhale reach your left arm by your ear exhale wrap your hand around your back really open through your left shoulder gazing up towards the sky if that feels good for you one more deep breath in and deep breath out release your arm back up to the sky press up into your warrior two nice deep breath in then exhale windmill your hands to the floor and step back into your vinyasa bend your elbows inhale upward facing dog exhale press back downward facing dog other side inhale extend your left leg up to the sky exhale bend your knee and open your hip keep your shoulders and your chest square to the floor as you open your left hip and lift your left knee up to the sky one more deep breath in then exhale square your hips and pull your knee in towards your chest step your foot forward pivot your back foot flat inhale press up into warrior one exhale melt into your front knee inhale lengthen through the side of your waist exhale interlace your hands behind your back inhale roll your shoulders back open your chest exhale dive your body forward to the inner part of your left leg make sure your left hip doesn't push out to the side so keep your hips as square as you can to the mat drawing your inner thighs towards each other engaging your legs on your next inhale press up to standing reach your arms up to the sky exhale open out into warrior two gaze over your fingertips as you bend deep into your left knee making sure your left knee is stacked over your left ankle keep your focus here you can do it then flip your left palm up inhale reverse warrior exhale bend deeper into your knee inhale straighten your front leg exhale press up scoot your back foot in if you need to inhale shift your weight forward and exhale release into your triangle pose looking up towards the sky inhale stretch your right arm by your ear and exhale wrap your arm behind your back opening more into your right shoulder close your eyes here if that feels good for you just enjoying this stretch then inhale release your right arm up exhale press up into your warrior two take a nice deep breath in then exhale windmill your hands to the floor and come into your vinyasa upward facing dog inhale downward facing dog exhale let's take a nice deep calming breath in and calming breath out look up in between your hands carefully hop or tiptoe your feet forward halfway lift inhale exhale fold inhale bend your knees chair pose then straight away exhale lift your heels reach your arms back inhale drop your heels chair pose exhale fold over your legs halfway lift inhale exhale step back into your chaturanga upward facing dog inhale broaden through your collarbones exhale downward facing dog inhale reach your right leg up exhale step your right foot in between your hands pivot your back foot flat inhale warrior one exhale interlace your hands behind your back deep breath in open through your heart 
exhale dive forward inhale come straight back up release your arms up to the sky and exhale into warrior two flip your right palm up inhale reverse warrior exhale bend deeper into your knee inhale straighten your front leg exhale press up shortening your stance if you need to inhale reach forward and exhale lower into triangle pose right arm reaches by your ear on your inhale then wraps behind your back on your exhale take your gaze down to the mat bend your right knee and come up into your half moon pose lift your left leg up to the sky flex your foot and if you can reach your left arm up really press down through all four corners of your right foot if you want more of a challenge bend your knee and see if you can grab a hold of your foot with your hand really press your foot into your hand opening through your heart and then exhale release into your forward fold halfway lift inhale exhale fold inhale bend your knees chair pose exhale lift your heels reach your arms back inhale lower your heels reach through your arms exhale fold over your legs halfway lift inhale exhale step back into chaturanga lowering your knees to the floor if you need to upward facing dog inhale downward facing dog exhale other side inhale reach your left leg up to the sky exhale step your left foot forward in between your hands pivot your back foot flat lift up into warrior one inhale then exhale interlace your hands behind your back i almost forgot the flow there inhale lift your chest and exhale dive forward inhale press up reach your arms up exhale open wide into warrior two inhale flip your palm up reverse warrior exhale hold then inhale straighten your left leg exhale press up inhale reach forward and exhale lower into your triangle pose reach your arm by your ear on your inhale then wrap your arm behind your back on your exhale really open through your right shoulder take your gaze up then lower your gaze to the mat bend your left knee and press up into your half moon flex your right foot really press down through all four corners of your left foot and if you want more of a challenge reach back for your right foot and really press your foot into your hand opening through your heart center feeling a beautiful stretch through your hips take one more deep breath in and then exhale release into your forward fold halfway lift inhale nice flat back exhale fold roll up to standing vertebra by vertebra reach your arms up to the sky inhale exhale lower your hands down to your chest let's now take tree pose so bend your right knee open it out to the side and place your right foot on the inner part of your left thigh take your hands to prayer find your focus here find your balance as you take nice deep breaths on your next inhale bend your right knee into your chest reach your arms up exhale extend your leg back into warrior three then set your right foot back inhale lift your chest crescent pose exhale melt into your front knee bend your back knee if you need to a little bit really tuck your pelvis under and then straighten your leg lower your hands to your chest shift forward and then twist over your left knee 
on your inhale really press your hands in towards each other and exhale breathe deeper into your twist really draw up through your navel relax through your shoulders Then on your next inhale, return through center, reach your arms up. Exhale, dive forward and kick your right leg up into standing split. If you want more of a challenge, see if you can hold on to the back of your left leg with your left hand as you reach your right leg up to the sky. Take one more deep breath in and then exhale, release your foot coming into your forward fold. Halfway lift, inhale, exhale, fold, then roll up to standing, inhale, reach your arms up, and exhale, hands to prayer. Let's do tree pose on the other side. So bend your left knee open, place your left foot on the inner part of your right thigh, and bring your hands to prayer. Keep drawing your navel in, really relax through your shoulders, and take deep breaths here. Then inhale, lift your left knee up into your chest, reach your arms up. Exhale, extend your leg back into warrior three. Then carefully lower your left foot to the floor. Inhale, reach your arms up, crescent lunge, bending your back knee first if you need to, tucking your hips under, and then straightening your back leg. Take a nice deep breath in, then exhale, hands to prayer. Inhale, shift forward and exhale, twist over to your right, hooking your left elbow on your right thigh. Press your hands together as you twist open over your right shoulder. On your next inhale, return through center, reach your arms up, then exhale, dive forward, standing splits keeping both hands on the floor, or if you want that challenge, see if you can wrap your right arm behind your right leg. Keep lifting your left leg up to the sky. One more deep breath in. And exhale, release your left foot down, coming into your forward fold. Halfway lift, inhale, fold, exhale. Roll up to standing, vertebra by vertebra. Inhale, reach your arms up and exhale, lower your hands to prayer. We're going to flow through all of that one last time. So inhale, chair pose, bend your knees. Exhale, lift your heels, swing your arms back. Inhale, lower your heels. Exhale, fold forward. Halfway lift, inhale, exhale, step back, chaturanga, bending your elbows. Inhale, upward facing dog, exhale, downward facing dog. Straight away, right leg lifts, inhale, exhale, step your right foot forward, pivot your back foot flat. Warrior one, inhale, exhale, interlace your hands behind your back. Inhale, open through your heart, Exhale, dive forward. Inhale, come back up, release your arms, and exhale into warrior two. Reverse warrior, inhale, exhale, hold. Then inhale, straighten your right leg, exhale, press up. Inhale, reach forward, and exhale, find your triangle pose. Stretch your arm by your ear, inhale, then wrap behind your back, exhale. Take one deep breath in and then take your gaze down to the mat and shift forward into your half moon pose. Reach your left arm up to the sky, flex your left foot or maybe hold on to your foot and really press your foot into your hand, opening through your heart. Wherever you are, take one more deep breath in and then release into your forward fold. Halfway lift, inhale. Exhale, fold. 
Roll up to standing. Inhale, reach your arms up. Then exhale, lift your left knee. Come into your tree pose, taking your hands to your heart, finding your balance, bringing your awareness into your breath. Then inhale, lift your left knee, reach your arms up. Exhale, extend your leg back, warrior three. Carefully set your foot down, crescent pose, inhale. Exhale, hands to prayer and twist to your right, coming into your twisted crescent lunge. Then roll your shoulders back, open through your chest. Then on your next inhale, return through center, reach your arms up. Exhale, dive forward into your standing splits. Really reach your left leg up. Take nice deep breaths. And then carefully release into your forward fold. You're doing so well. Halfway lift, inhale, fold, exhale. Inhale, bend your knees, chair pose. Exhale, lift your heels, swing your arms back. Inhale, lower your heels and exhale, fold forward. Halfway lift, inhale. Exhale, step back into Chaturanga. Upward facing dog, inhale, roll your shoulders back. Downward facing dog, exhale. One last time, you can do it. Inhale, reach your left leg up. Exhale, step your left foot forward, pivot your back, heel flat. Reach your arms up, inhale. Exhale, interlace your hands behind your back. Open through your chest, inhale. Exhale, dive forward. Inhale, come back up, release your arms. Exhale, warrior two. Reverse warrior, inhale. Exhale, hold. Then inhale, straighten your left leg. Exhale, press up. Reach forward on your inhale. And exhale, triangle pose. Reach your right arm by your ear, inhale, then wrap behind your back, exhale. Really rolling your right shoulder open. Then take your gaze down to the mat, shift forward into half moon. Really flex your right foot, engage through your legs and your glutes and reach your right arm up. Bending your right knee, grabbing a hold of your right foot if you want that extra challenge. Really press your foot into your hand. One more deep breath in. And then exhale, release. Halfway lift, inhale. Fold, exhale. Roll up to standing, reach your arms up. Deep breath in. And then exhale, lift your right knee up. Let's take our tree pose. Really press your right foot into the inner thigh of your left leg. Standing up nice and tall, reaching up through the crown of your head. Then inhale, pull your right knee up. Exhale, extend your leg back and carefully set your foot down on the floor. Inhale, crescent pose. Exhale, hands to prayer and twist over your left leg. Really press your hands together as you breathe into your twist. On your next inhale, return through center, reach your arms up, exhale, dive forward, last standing splits. Reach your right leg up a little bit higher, pointing through your toes. Holding on to the back of your left leg if you want that extra challenge. One more deep breath in and then exhale, release. Well done. Halfway lift, inhale, nice flat back. Exhale, fold. Roll up to standing, vertebra by vertebra. Reach your arms up, inhale. And exhale, lower your hands to prayer. Take your hands onto your heart, close your eyes. And just take this moment to observe all the beautiful benefits of your practice on your body today. Then open your eyes, inhale, bend your knees, chair pose, sit your hips low, 
Exhale, lift your heels and carefully lower your glutes down to your heels. Open your knees, keeping your feet together. Walk your hands forward, finding a nice forward fold. This should feel really nice for your hips and for your lower back. Then carefully walk your hands back towards your body, close your legs together, reach your arms forward and sit your glutes down on the mat. Let's roll ourselves vertebra by vertebra down onto our back. Separate your feet hip distance apart and shuffle your heels in towards your glutes. Press through your heels and roll your hips up into your bridge pose. Roll your shoulders under and maybe interlace your hands behind your back. Make sure your chin is away from your chest. Really press through your feet, opening through your heart. Then release your arms and carefully roll your hips back down. Let your knees fall open, keeping the soles of your feet together. Place one hand on your heart and one hand on your belly. Take this moment to think of one thing that you are grateful for today. Then bring your feet back in, place your hands on the floor and press up into another bridge pose. Roll your shoulders under, interlace your hands and really lift your hips up nice and high. Take one more deep breath in and then release your hands and exhale, roll your hips down. This time, let's hug our knees in towards our chest. Maybe rock your spine side to side. Do whatever feels good for you. Then rock the length of your spine up to seated and straighten your legs out in front of you, flexing your feet. Sitting up nice and tall, inhale, reach your arms up, and exhale, reach forward, holding on to wherever you can on your legs. Keep a soft bend through your knees here if you need to. Really focusing on folding your belly button down towards your thighs, versus your forehead to your legs. Keeping as much length through your spine as you can. Then on your next inhale, lift your chest and exhale, release. Let's bend our right knee open now, keeping our left leg straight. Inhale, reach your right arm up and exhale, side bend over to the left. Turning your chest up towards the sky, feeling a beautiful stretch through the side body. Then come back up and switch sides. Bend your left knee, extend your right leg. Inhale, reach your left arm up and exhale, side bend over to the right. Really reaching through your left fingertips as you turn your chest up towards the sky. Then come back up and let's now open both legs out to the side. Flex your feet, making sure your toes are pointed up to the sky. Either stay here, sitting up nice and tall, or if you want more of a stretch, walk your hands forward, coming into your forward fold. Make sure that you're keeping your spine as straight as you can and that your knees and your toes are still pointed up towards the sky. It doesn't matter how deep you go into this stretch. It only matters that you feel a stretch and that it feels good for you. Then carefully walk your hands back towards your body and help your legs together coming into your cross-legged position. Let's finish class today, sitting up nice and tall. Place one hand on your heart and one hand on your belly. 
and close your eyes. Breathe naturally here, feeling all of the beautiful benefits of your yoga practice today on your body and on your mind. Take this time to thank yourself for showing up today on your mat and for taking the time to do something to make your body, your mind and your soul feel so good. Stay here in this moment of stillness for as long as you need or if you'd like to finish your practice with me, open your eyes and let's take one more deep breath in, reach your arms up to the sky and exhale, lower your hands down to prayer. Thank you so much, everyone. I hope you enjoyed today's energizing yoga flow. If you want to see more classes like this, don't forget to like this video, leave me a comment, share this video with a friend or family member and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much again and have the most beautiful day.